wild scene at a busy shopping center in Daly City where a Sam's Trans bus jumped a curve, plowed right through a Target parking lot. KPX5 Sean Chitness is live at the Ceremony Center. Sean, you spoke with witnesses with what happened there. Well, Ryan, investigators right now are trying to figure out exactly what happened. If you take a look behind me, you will see part of the parking lot is still closed off. And while they have been able to clear most of the vehicles that were involved, you can still see that Sam Trans bus there, even one of the shopping carts that was crushed in this crash. Now, if you take a look at some of the video we got from Chopper 5, you can get a better sense of just how big of a crash this was and how many cars were involved. Sam Trans tells us that this happened just before noon when one of their buses crashed into to 16 different cars here at the Saramonte Center. We know multiple people were injured with four people taken to SF General and one person is in critical condition. Now coming in and out of the Target store that is located here, many people were stunned to see those remaining cars and the bus in the parking lot hours later. One security guard says that he was looking the other way when the crash happened. I was here, I heard it. I turned and I knew it was an unusual sound. And I looked and I saw the bus and it was coming down, it was wobbly. And then you could hear the crunching and the crashing. Well, like everyone else, just question what happened. Why is there a bus in the parking lot? And it's just so traumatic, people getting injured. It's, you know, it's, it's, it's just a downer, <laughs> you know? That's exactly what it is. And I just hope and pray everybody would be okay. And so while investigators are trying to figure out what happened and caused that bus to end up here in that parking lot, it is worth noting that there is a bus stop inside the shopping center. And so we are seeing plenty of Sam's Trans buses coming in and out of this shopping center throughout the afternoon and even this evening. And as we still have part of this parking lot closed off, that is going to have an impact on the cars not only coming in to the different stores here, but also on the surrounding streets. So something to keep in mind if you will be in the area this evening. Ryan, back to you. All right, thank you very much. Sean Chitness reporting live in Daly City.